My name is Peter Knudsen. I play guitar for All Mode, and uh, I think our ice cream flavor would be uh, Rocky Road. <laughs> <laughs> Um, my name is Nathan, and I play voice for All Mode. And I think if All Mode was a certain kind of ice cream, it would. I'm sticking with it, guys. It's vanilla with a cherry on top, and I don't care. Maybe some whipped cream on the side. I don't know. I guess I, that is my decision. I made it. <laughs> I'm, I'm Ned. I I play the keyboards. You'll find me tucked away in the corner of the stage, and. Um, I, I'm gonna go with an out there answer. I think that we're dipping Dots. Ooh. My name's Alex Piazza, I play bass guitar, and I guess I would say our ice cream player would be Neapolitan, because there's many layers. Dang. <laughs> I'm Rio, I play drums, and I don't, I'm gonna feed off Ned, banana split dipping Dots. Ooh. So really good. You can eat really them in good. space. You can? Yeah. You can. I think we're all influenced by a lot of pop songs and pop music out there, so I think we kind of just wanted to put our like put our own spin on it. I'm gonna say pop dance music because isn't that like why we do it? Yep, yeah. exactly. A song usually starts with a riff by somebody, and it's definitely a combination of all of us, hands down. Yeah, Ar arrangement is definitely the band's duty, like the final flow of the song and um, how it emerges and where you know it where it breaks and where it, uh, you know, lightens up and where the, the climax of the song is. Sometimes a song's done and then Alex comes up the bridge or Peter mm -hmm. uses his uh, Maxi Childs trio <laughs> songbook <laughs> to, <laughs> to come up with a great bridge for us. Nate writes almost all the lyrics, you know, with like a little bit of help from each of us at times, because mm -hmm. um, I, you know, trust is important. Yeah, it's one of those things where I have this weird process when it comes to creating lyrics. Um, basically, I start with a melody. So whatever these guys are doing, um, I'll try to fit myself into that like an instrument. Doing that and then letting the words come out as gibberish, which is something that these guys have gotten used to over a year and a half. Because I'll just be like singing into the microphone and I'll just be like, Straight up, it'll be just gibberish, but melodic mm. gibberish, you know? You start, you speak gibberish, but all of a sudden, the words start to form um, underneath that gibberish. So it's like a subconscious gibberish with a melody attached to it. Whatever you're doing, whether you're like trying to self-actualize and you're writing lyrics based off that, or if you're, if you're mournful because this girl's broken your heart or whatnot, um, whatever comes out subconsciously is like the best in terms of lyrics and for for me I've found out that that just comes out and it forms itself over time. And what's the name of the website again? Hearallamode.com. Okay, hearallamode.com is the time. name of the website. So if you if you just go to hearallamode.com, we'll have all of the updates for you. How about? I know people use Facebook all the time. We got Facebook too, just under allamode one word. But yeah, hearallamode.com, hearallamode.com. You literally just discovered your band's domain name for the website just now, didn't no, you? No, I just didn't want to screw it up. <laughs> I just didn't want to screw it up, Rio.